Hello everybody, welcome, it's episode 10 of uh, The Walking Dead. Here we go. Myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge. Now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. You are. <laughs> Fucker. No! No! Stop me! Get me! Get me! When you cover yourself in their smell, Rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Now. Go on. You don't need to see this. Yes, I do. I'm not going anywhere. So for those who don't remember, I'm not a fan of Sarah. I think she's fucking useless. And I refuse to help her. I've done my best. I told her to grow up. She hasn't. Fuck her. The audio is going a bit weird there. Sorry about that, guys. done something wrong here with the port because this sound effect should not be too loud. So 
so uh, I just want to make it clear. I'm sorry for the sound. Now Rebecca wants my help. Rebecca's been a bitch to me throughout this entire series and now she wants my fucking help. Pop your baby out and let's get going. Rebecca, will you stop being such a fucking moron and get moving? If anyone thinks these uh, scenes are familiar, well, uh, you uh, may not be surprised to know that this is the uh, average look of the Justin Bieber concerts. And now they're all miraculously clean. We need to keep going. I mean, we're almost there, right? I hope so. It's getting so damn cold. I wish I could stop, but I can't. Not until we're with the others. We need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God. What if they aren't there? If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. 
Fine. Sorry. Jesus. I don't even know if we're safe. Is that better? What if the herd is still following us. We're fine. It's been quiet, but who knows? It's been at least an hour since I saw any walkers. Carver's people should be keeping them busy for a while. Yeah, be lucky. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking about the others. How could I leave Alvin behind? It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If you can call that working, we could have... I don't know. The plan worked. We got out of there. Most of us. Look, I know that some of your people didn't make it, but Carver was crazy. Staying would have only prolonged the inevitable. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of course! We panicked. We were scared. The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... I have to stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Okay, we'll leave you behind. See ya. Yeah. Take a minute. Thank you. What? Right. What you gotta do, get by a log, spread your legs, plop it out, and off we go. Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Kenny might know what to do. He had a family. Let's hope he made it to the meetup point then. <laughs> oh, Papa Squish, take care of yourself. Thanks for coming in. It's been great not talking to you. What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just making conversation. There was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Who with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food. And, you know, other stuff. Yeah. And guys, that baby is coming, like it or not. Thanks, Fred. It's great, and great then, finding you. It's going to be I hope I've entertained you a little bit at least. You assume I won't be capable. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... She died? I don't need your pity. You don't... You don't have the right... Jane! I didn't mean it. Shit. Jane, wait. Oh, damn it. What's your fault, Rebecca? Selfish bitch. You can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. It had been so long. We were starting to worry no one else would make it. Oh, besides. Where is everyone else? We were hoping you would know. This memorial was fine as a meeting spot. No way we can stay here a long time. I told you. That's why we're waiting. And as soon as everyone else gets here, we'll figure something out. You wanted to leave without us? What? No. I wanted to go out and try to find him. Well, what does Penny want to do? I tried to talk to you, and you flipped down on me. I thought he yelling. Scary shit. I know, but he probably didn't mean it. It was scary. I hate to say it, but Sabrina's on her way out. I'm probably gonna turn soon. Oh, what's up? Is, uh, <clears throat> is he gonna take care of her? Dang! I know it's not pretty, but it's better than the alternative. It's not our decision to make. Shut the fuck up, Rebecca. Penny. He'll do the right thing, even if it's hard. All I'm saying is, the offer's there, if he wants it. Clem, I was thinking now that you're here, maybe you could go talk to him. Why do I have to fucking do it? I don't want to. Clem, I know it's hard, and that you might be scared. No. But it might be best. 
Why is it always me? It's all right, Serena. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna be here with you. Right till the end. Hi, Kenny. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? Except we just wanted a little fucking time alone. To say goodbye. <laughs> it's okay, babe. It's okay. We're gonna get through this. We're gonna do what we gotta do. We're gonna play the shit hand that this shit world dealt us. Just leave us alone. Don't you think you've already done enough for today? Tried to save her. I said, look at her. She is going to die because of you. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? That's not how it works. Clementine, this is a point where you say, For the last time, just fuck you, Kenny. To say goodbye. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Well, go. Fuck you, Rebecca. Kenny's really mad at me. I can't just expect him to bounce back. Why didn't you talk to me, you fucking lazy bitch? What have you brought to the group other than the moaning, Still, nagging, and an unborn exactly child? Let's figure out what we're gonna do now. We got no food, no water. It's gonna be damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. Uh, uh, Kenny will have a plan. Mike, honey. Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands, too. What, suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? Seeing you people floundering the minute things don't go according to plan has just got me on edge, all right? Well, I don't exactly see you stepping up to help right now, either. Rebecca needs a safe, warm place to have her baby. Maybe we should keep moving and find one. You can rest for a few minutes. Me and Clem will scout ahead and double back. Just make sure you're ready to move when we get here. Stubborn pregnant bitch, fucking liar traitor, and decent chick. Who am I going to go with, I wonder? Listen, Rebecca, if anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to. I don't know. But you better keep that close. Come on, Clem. Look, I'm gonna level with you. There's no real point in scouting ahead. And you should know that finding your friends, that's a shot in the dark. Well, then why'd we come out here? I wanted to talk to you, away from them. You wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart. But I still... I just gotta warn you. That group is cracking. I've seen it before. And, well, a lot of times, it's better to be on your own. Oh, no shit. I know you see what I'm talking about. You don't want to be here when they start. You know, bad stuff happens to you when you're alone, too. But your odds are better. There's nobody to watch your back. And when something does happen, there's nobody there to help you. How much help is Kenny gonna be? 
What he's going through? He's more of a liability than anything. And Rebecca's situation is not making things better back there. You get enough broken people together, and all you're gonna get are broken decisions. How can you get along without trusting anyone? That's exactly how I get along. For what it's worth, I like most of the people in your crew. But groups fall apart. People get killed. Then why did you bring me with you? I'm just trying to give you the tools you need to make it, if you wanna. Like your jacket. It looks warm, but a walker will bite right through that. My sister Jamie had a good leather one. Wish I still had it. You could've. wanted a sister. I used to make my babysitter Sandra play a game that we were secret sisters. It was stupid kid stuff. You know, being a big sister is, well, it's funny. It's really easy to be mean. Oh? You know, hide her toys, make fun of her bad haircut, give her the bad haircut. On purpose. I mean, I did put the gum there. I figured I should get it out. I don't even know why. What could I do? She thought I was her best friend. I couldn't go unpunished. <laughs> Every summer, we'd go to this amusement park in Virginia. But the best part wasn't the rides. It was that nobody knew us there. And I'd... I'd pretend we weren't sisters. Just... friends. <sighs> All right. Jackpot. These walkers got some good stuff. They're just walkers. Why would they have anything? Well, pretty recently, they weren't walkers, were they? Good point. Take a look. Old walkers are a waste of time. They're holding credit cards and busted old pagers. But these ones weren't walkers all that long ago. They were survivors. They might have useful stuff. That one's not coming back. Let's see what else he's got. I'll check this one. Zombie butts. Find anything? Driver's licenses. Two of them. Well, I guess some people just can't leave the past behind. Hold on to them. Memo's getting hard to come by, and things aren't going to get better. Smart haircut. Thanks. So, has your crew always been so dysfunctional? No, nope, it's just everybody's a fucking moron. Fit in there. I've actually only been with them a little while. I don't know what it was like before I got there. But Kenny was different. I know that. That's it. A nail file. These things are great. Sharpen a blade, strike a flint. Amy always had one in her purse. It jabbed my hand when I went reaching in. <sighs> Never be too sure with these things. Here, give me a hand. Looks like your friend didn't make it. Sorry. I don't know what to tell you. All 
we know is that she was here. It could be a good sign. Don't go getting your hopes up. Look, Clem, I know what you want me to say, but... Get off! Shit! Okay, come on. We gotta find a way in. Looks like there's an opening over there. Oh, that's Nick. It's Nick. Look, he's your friend. You should do this. Aim for the brain. There you go. It's all right. It's done. If it comes to it, if Luke or Sarah or anybody needs to be put down, you gotta be ready for it. No hesitation. You know that, right? It never gets any easier, does it? As in for me. That hatchet of yours seems to get stuck pretty easily. It's gonna get you killed. Here, use this. Very effective. You can do this. Sound too good. Clock is ticking. I'm ready. I know you are. I need to get a better look. How about you get the close one and I'll hop the fence to get the other? Go for it. doing I watch this got a nice little addition to your arsenal pick out the knees first then put a knife in the back of its head when it's down all right let's get a look at what we've got on deck of the dead? People. How do we get in? If we can make enough noise on this side, we can lure those walkers over here. Then we might just 
must be able to go through that other trailer and get to your friends. What do you think of that? I mean, I'm just making it up as I go along. If you think that's best, I'm with you. Good. What's going to grab their attention? Uh, you can flick your tits out at them. That could work. Well, there ain't much there, is there, to be honest? Move it. I would have left already, but I, I got Sarah here, and... Sarah's a fucking retard. Leave her alone. I, I don't know what to do about her. Punch her in the it's face. Better. That'd be a good start. Make you get a fucking you clue. Help. That could help. Sarah, look. Look, it's Clem. See, it's just like I told you. that They're okay. Sarah, come on. We, we have to go now. Was she bitten? Did they get her? No, she ain't bit. She's just yeah. stupid. I, do. I can't snap her out of it. Okay, I tried to carry her, but I, I guess Carver messed me up pretty good back there. I don't know. It's just after Carlos, she just lost it. Started running through the woods like a maniac. I, I chased her for I don't know how long, and then she saw this mobile home made a beeline right for her. I'm just glad y'all are here. We're not out of the woods yet. What are we gonna do about her? Leave her alone. We gotta do something. What if we help her to her feet and just get her moving? No, no, it, it's not gonna work, okay? She freaks out anytime you get near her. Listen, I, uh, we're gonna tear this place open pretty soon. We can't stay. So we, we gotta get her up, or we gotta. Well, 
I've been trying. I've been trying for hours. I can barely get her to look at me. Then she's a fucking waste of well, time. Fucking I'll just leave her. Maybe it seems like you're all alone right now, but you're not. Yes, I am. What about Luke and Jane and me? We came here because of you. All of us in the group. We're your family now. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Can we just leave the stupid Crap, bitch? Surrounded. But what about the skylight? Oh, we got. Plan. There's no time. I agree. Plan. We can't be kids anymore, Sarah. You need to grow up, or you'll die. There aren't any other choices. Get to the skylight now. Come on, I'll boost you. Oh, my God. Oh, sake. What's going on back there? My ribs. We're gonna need something to stand on. Luke, get over here. Help me hold this. See what you can find. Can we use that? Yeah, that would work. What? Oh, okay, ready? On three. One, two, three! She ain't gonna grab she can fuck off. Bit too fucking late, sweetie. We didn't have a choice. Okay, there's nothing we can do. There's, there's nothing we can do. She was a fucking moron. She's been Getting people killed, it's good that she's fucking dead. How's that for realism? Precisely, Drew. Fucking she was useless. never going to make it in this world. No, she wasn't. She was never going to make it. She was a fucking moron. She never did a damn thing right. She couldn't even fucking yeah. cut berries guess, off of a fucking plant. There was just nothing we could do. I tried so hard to get through to her. Did you try punching her in the cunt? That might have worked. What happened in there? The good old cunt pun. When you went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just... I'd seen that kind of thing before. 
I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. It's just the way things are. It's okay, I get it. Things aren't always simple. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. And when you really look at it, maybe it's better this way. For everyone. You know, I should have gotten through to him. I should have done. No, she was a fucking moron who couldn't do a damn thing fucking right. It's good that she's dead and we can only blame her father for coddling this stupid bitch for so fucking long. Good thing is Carlos is now dead as well, so now they're a happy family in deathdom. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her. Or push her, or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time, walkers cornered us, forced us up to the roof, and, and when they kept coming, I, I couldn't make her jump, couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted, and I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself. You left your sister. Jane, I'm really sorry. It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell. And all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way too. No, Sarah Jane. was a fucking moron. No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Come on, let's get back to your friends. Sarah was a fucking moron who couldn't even take berries off of a plant without fucking it up. And her stupidity got uh, the one armed guy killed whose name I forget. She wouldn't take the hint to shut her fucking face in the fucking. Son of a bitch. Reggie, that's the one, thank you. You found him. Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane. I don't know what would have happened. Wait, where's Sarah? Dead. And Nick? Dead. Oh, uh, Rebecca. How about we uh we go for a walk? Mm -hmm. Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about. Oh, for fuck's sake, what now? No. What else are you fucking lied to no. us about, huh? <laughs> I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know. Does Luke know anything about babies? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Kenny had a family. He could help. Where is he? Sarita in there not long after you left. I don't know if he's done it yet. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. I've seen him like this before. That's why I was thinking you could talk to him. Why don't you I talk to him? Just you, why is it always me who well. has to fucking do something? You because you're too much of a fucking crackhead coward to do anything. Do if it weren't for the baby. Why do I still have the stupid bitch's glasses as well? We need your help with Rebecca's baby. No one else knows what to do. She didn't want me to wait, but I had to. In case by some crazy chance, she didn't come back. That beautiful face. 
so I waited. I'm sorry, Kenny. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. Then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beat every day. Look, gotcha, Sabrina. No peace, no rest. The punches just keep coming. Finished me off. Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That baby's almost here, and Rebecca needs your help. Yeah, I guess she does. Now, nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. That'd kill me yet, anyway. Diva, why are you doing that now? Well. Oh, shit. Does that mean what are we supposed to do? <sighs> oh, Diva, I ask. And I wonder about you sometimes. Are you okay? Right, Rebecca, what you want to do, you want to lay on the bench, Feet spread your legs, That's and just feels. pretend it's a ping pong ball. Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. Let's leave her behind. Annie, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca travel like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. This place doesn't seem safe for a baby being born. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike. Go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Clem. I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. Fuck you, Bonnie. I'd love for you to give me and Mike a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking, how do we know Janie just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I don't know if Jane will come back. I think she's scared about the baby. That's what I was afraid of. That's why it might be a good idea to have you go with her. Just something to think about. Warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. It all sound right? Maybe I should go with Jade. Better hurry and catch up then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. I don't think I've actually ever gone with Jane in the previous uh, times I've played this. I know I've got to be here many times. Oh, excuse me. I know that I've gone to the museum many times. Because that's where they get the confederate coat, if I remember rightly, or the flag or whatever it is. Oh, hey. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it 
it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. Can we just leave him? I like the height. Come on, come on, Jan, let's just go. Partner, don't let it get to your head. Let's go. Go on, Jane. Let's just leave him behind. I hope this place is what we're looking for. Clementine and Jane. God knows we could use a break. Check this out. This gate's still locked. Which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know? Wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. You might need to bust the mechanism. Find anything? No, not even trash. It's broken. Ow! Shit! You okay? Yeah. yeah. I think I almost had it. Keep looking. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca would make it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so- Why is he coming up here? No idea. We should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. The last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. We should just try and stay out of sight till he's gone. Good call. Shit. Hide now. Подожди, подожди. I'm just a kid. Please, don't hurt me. Do you understand me? Yes. Hey, Margo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone, especially маленькая девочка, a little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. Back up. Put the bag down. Glenn, 
Make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I swear to you. You just need to make sure you're not a threat. You durak. Clementine, hurry. Please. Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. Is it just you and your sister? No. I have many friends. In the woods. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No! You are not nice people! You have already left me defenseless, and now you... You take my sister's medicine? You are worry. Hey! We've got people who are suffering. Who need this medicine? Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it! Clementine, we need people that stuff! People are suffering just as much as yours! You are not special! Clementine, yes? You must believe... don't believe a fucking word about your sick Please sister. Please don't make my sister suffer. She has been through enough. Oh. You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Pusha, thank you, Clementine. Thank you. Here, if you do have some sick sisters, the next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. I can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? I thought you were gonna shoot him. Why? Did you want me to? Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place opened. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. Observation deck? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from the flight. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. Jane and I were trying to open the gift shop and a stranger showed up. What? Shh. This is the last thing we need right now. What happened? He had a bunch of medicine and stuff. Jane wanted to take it. Yeah? Did you? Glad you're okay. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah, I'm all right. Yeah, she's trying to get the gift shop open. No, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I like her. She's honest, and she knows what she's doing. Yep, that's more than I can say for some. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship.
not supposed to be in labor yet, can you? What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Everything Alvin did was for you and the baby. Back at Carver's. In the office. He stayed behind to stop the people chasing us. He died to keep us safe. Jesus. Of course. Of course he did. I know it's a waste of time. But I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Uh, things I should have told him Remind me what that achievement is. How am I ever going to do this without him? Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's going to be a girl. Oh, yeah? That big dummy never did have Oh, you're going to do that with me tomorrow, then? I've got a feeling this one's a boy. You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Of course you are. Ah. Oh, shit. I got this. Well, we ain't seen Mike or Bonnie in a while. Well, okay, so there's me. I don't trust him. So, okay, so we, if we've got if we've got you, we're gonna need two. We're gonna need three more. <laughs> you know I'm playing with you, Drew. I go, what was I supposed to be doing? <sighs> well, if you can get a couple of other people together, then we'll do that tomorrow. You went with Jane. She didn't take off, did she? Take off? Why do you think she'd take off? We found a place for Rebecca to have the baby. An observation deck with a gift shop. It's way up high and pretty safe from the wind. Oh, that's great. Just give me like ten more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty handed. I just want to help. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. Nothing sneaking up on us. I watch this side, you watch the other. Field. You think maybe they say that stuff about Warren, like it's just to get people out of the way? No, oh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you didn't have to come with me. You would have flown no, this place. I wanted to. Never mind. You want some broken glass? I tell you, I sure don't like being near a graveyard with the. I sure hope we can find something to take back. Me too.
They're just for show. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. It seems like you're with us now. That's what matters most. I haven't found a jacket. It's great, but uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh, we can't put Brooke back there in a Confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. I guess it's better than nothing, though. Yes, true. And to cut off the next inevitable question, no, I won't. Because I know what you, I know what you're about to ask, and I'm telling you, no, 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 no. No, 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 and no. Clean. That's just what we need. probably got Legionnaire's disease by you now. Kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. That's not funny. I don't see why I'm the one that has to crawl into danger every time just because I'm the smallest. No, you're right. Let's try something else. Maybe I can just reach through to the lock? You okay, Bonnie? It's just a bump. I'm gonna be all right. I should have tried to crawl through. I might have spotted him better. It's all right. I, I shouldn't have asked anyway. Let me see your arm. No, I... I didn't get bit. Just old scars. Crack addict scars. At least now we got something to bring back. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Come, Clem, lift with your knees, not with your back. Hey, I got this. That looks pretty heavy. Oh, that's all right. No, it looks like a Call of Duty, we'll bottled warfare. <laughs> Carter was crazy, but at least his shelves were always full. 
We're gonna have to be conservative as hell. You're right. I thought it looked like so much. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys! Come on, stick close. I just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. You can eat raccoon? I need the shit out of that raccoon. Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I'm starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Where is it? I think it went over there. There he is! It's coming your way. Walk him! Yes, it was. Come on, let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. We don't have much time to waste. You're telling me your arms ain't tired? Nope. I could do this all day. No! No! Shit! Shit! Oh, God! Breathe no! like I told you. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Shit, walkers. I think they're that close without anyone seeing them. That was Luke. Kenny, we've got to do something. You just keep that baby safe. Kenny, we can't stay here. Clementine, where's the place you and Jane found? I'll show you. Good. Someone help me out. Oh, God, there's so many. Mike, help Kenny! On it! I think it's actually the first time I've sent Mike and Kenny. Liam, I, I don't think he's okay. He's losing it. I mean, that... That is... I don't think he's okay either. This is... Looks like Rebecca, move your fucking pregnant ass. Wait, no, it's not your ass, it's pregnant. You know what I mean. Kenny! Come on, man. Let's go! I About think the zombie it's sounded like Yoda. I almost forgot what Clementine. Je Jesus, Clem, it's just not. Uh, What's going on? Well, uh, I mean, in here. Let's get you comfortable. What the fuck are you two doing up here, Kenny? What's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. Rebecca's having the baby. Now? No! Fuck. I'm sorry. For fuck's sake, just shove your fingers down her throat so she shuts her face. They're coming up the stairs! Here. We should. You want to help? Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. Been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs! Shoot them before they get to us! I'm going outside. I'll help pull them back. No. I've got Rebecca. Here they come! Here. We can't let them up here. Ah! 
somebody shove a fucking pair of socks down her throat. There are too many of them. Shit! Keep shooting! They are not getting up here! Find something to block this gate! Help us! We can block the gate with this! I'll help, I'm coming. If we had brought Sarah with us, that's where the stupid bitch would have died. Ladies and gentlemen, we now have bait. coat we found. Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? Do you want to hold him? I don't think I should. It's really okay. We're family. Yeah, that's okay. Thanks. Ryder Clementine, you don't like babies? She doesn't have to hold him if she doesn't want to. Fair enough. Let me take it. You both should rest. Especially you. When's the last time you slept, Kenny? Oh, about two years ago. I'm fine. Plus, somebody's gotta watch you while Mama gets your beauty sleep. You never forget that smell. Go. 
I understand. Good. I was worried this was gonna turn into a thing. You know, Jamie, Sarah, I'm not gonna stick around and watch it happen to you too. You know the score. I'm not like them. No. But give it enough time, and everyone's luck runs out. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They make you feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. Can... can I go with you? No, you can't. That's not how this works. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Versatility is not overrated. Thanks. Yeah. I, uh... I gotta go. be asleep by now. You okay? No. I guess we all got stuff on our minds. <sighs> Temperature's dropping. I'm low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore, see if we can find some place to scavenge. What? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit, how did she... God damn it, kid. You know what? Just lay off. No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two can roll around like fucking teenagers. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. What do you want from me? Look, I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. You know what, Jane? She made an offer, and Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit. So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else. Fine. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Penny! I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. A whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa! What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days, at, at the least. We've got that baby formula. That won't help the rest of us. And what about Kelly? We'll freeze out here. All right, that sounds... I'll be fine. If there's a chance there's food, we have to risk it. That's, uh, that's okay. correct, Drew. You fine. can't restart races. Want. Look, we should all try to get some sleep. It's been a long day.
You all right? She's exhausted. We all are. We should have stayed put. We should have stayed put until she was in better shape. She wasn't gonna get no better back there. We gotta find food. Get her someplace warm. This looked like someplace warm to you? We can still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done, like always. Kenny's right. We have to keep going. Thank you, Clem. I'm glad you see things my way. Uh, uh, oh. Over here. It's a place to sit. Rebecca, let me take the baby. Uh, he's okay. I've got him. No. You rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being weird about it. Yeah, you kind of have been. Not just right now. Don't get all bent into a pretzel. I was just trying to help. People are too damn sensitive sometimes. Hello? What is this? Yes, Lishna! Arvo? Arvo? Dane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. That's the guy? You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. <sighs> Alright. Hello. Your name is Clementine. Yes? Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. How is your sister doing? Sister? Not so good. I need, uh, uh thanks for bandages. I need bandages. Are you hurt? No. Nikaki Arushi! Nikaki Arushi! Nikaki Arushi! Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что мы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь, чтобы я взял? Откуда я знаю, чтобы у них не было? What did your friend say? I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a little. Uh, we didn't rob you. Robbed. And they want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on. What the hell? Why get excited? It wasn't me who took your stuff. It was Jane. It, it wasn't any of us. Jane? Where's the other woman? Что происходит? Я была двое раньше. Хорошо, один? Я здесь? I do not see a woman who was with you. She's gone. She left the group. It's a trap. I know it. Они прячутся. Я знаю, что они прячутся. Hey, hey, hey. This can be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. Fine, my ass! Please, nice tell them not to shoot! I, uh, I... Arvo, что происходит здесь? The fuck is she saying? If I get excited... I will not let them touch that baby! You have a baby with you? У них грудничковый ребенок! Знаешь, что хорошо до тебя. Опусти оружие кажется, сейчас. Не сейчас. Не слишком много. Бурику отойди. Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking Please. shoot it. I'll do you it. Do it. Don't, don't it. even drop try it, it motherfucker. I guarantee I'm a better shot than move. you are. I'll drop you both before you can play. Everybody be cool. This doesn't have to go down like this. Don't kill us. Look, you don't look like stupid people. 
That has to be one of the quickest fucking zombie turns in this entire series. For plot convenience, of course. <laughs> Me and 59.4% of other people got tired of Sarah's bullshit. Keeps it. 